Top Gun fans have been waiting for a sequel for 35 years, and it appears like the wait is finally over. Top Gun Maverick, which was shot in 2018 and was originally scheduled for a summer 2019 release, had been moved to the summer of 2020 to quote, allow production to work out all of the complex flight sequences, according to Deadline. Then the globe erupted, with a global epidemic forcing Paramount Pictures to reschedule the film's debut numerous times in 2020 and 2021 to avoid movie theater closures and maximize possible audiences. Fans of this classic will not have to wait much longer to see their favorite pilots return to the big screen, since the film will be released this year. Fingers crossed. Tightly. <laughs> Given that the original picture had a devoted fan base and was one of the biggest films of the 1980s, we may expect the new film to be one of the year's major cinematic events. So while we wait, here's everything that we know about Top Gun Maverick so far. So who's going to play Maverick in Top Gun Maverick? Captain Pete Maverick Mitchell, a flight instructor noted for his daring maneuvers and pirouettes in the air, will be reprised by Tom Cruise. The sequel will also see the return of Val Kilmer as Tom Iceman Kazansky, and it appears that Cruz was enthusiastic about having the actor repeat his role. According to producer Jerry Bruckheimer, quote, We must have Val and we must have him back. We must include him in the film. He was the motivator. We all wanted him, but Tom insisted that if he made another Top Gun, Val had to be in it, end quote. It will be interesting to watch how this works given that the beloved actor now has throat cancer and requires technology to communicate. Aside from these two big ones, who else will be in the film? Well, several A-list celebrities will also play new roles in Top Gun Maverick. Lieutenant Bradley Rooster Bradshaw, the son of Maverick's best buddy Nick Goose Bradshaw, who died in the first film, will be played by Miles Teller. Fans should definitely expect some friction between Rooster and Maverick because he is a pilot trainee. Jennifer Connelly will also appear in the new film as Penny Benjamin, the daughter of a former Admiral and Maverick's love interest. John Hamm, Ed Harris, Glenn Powell, Lewis Pullman, and Monica Barbaro are among other actors considered. So what is the plot of Top Gun Maverick? The official narrative of Top Gun Maverick is obviously being kept a mystery until the film's release, but we can make some educated predictions based on promotional teasers and trailers. Maverick will be training the next generation of Navy aviators in the film, but things will get complex when he is assigned to train a crew for a special high-risk mission. According to the official synopsis for the film, the future sequel will return to the world of the original. Pete Maverick Mitchell is where he belongs after more than 30 years of duty as one of the Navy's top aviators, pushing the edge as a brave test pilot and avoiding the advancement in rank that would have ground him. Maverick meets Lieutenant Bradley Bradshaw, callsign Rooster, the son of Maverick's late friend and radar intercept officer Lieutenant Nick Bradshaw, alias Goose, while training a detachment of Top Gun grads for a specialized mission the likes of which no living pilot has ever seen. Maverick is driven into a confrontation with his own greatest fears as he faces an uncertain future and confronts the demons of his past, culminating in a mission that demands the ultimate sacrifice from those chosen to fly it. We may even witness fresh versions of our favorite scenes, as images from the film set show Tom Cruise and Jennifer Connelly recreating the classic motorcycle scene from the original film. Maverick may be a new instructor with a new love interest, but he has remained essentially the same person he has always been, pushing limits and loving it while doing it. Top Gun Maverick will also contain some stunning live stunts, since Cruise and the other actors have been flying real fighter jets rather than depending on CGI, and Cruise insists on doing the majority of his own stunts, as is his custom. It will undoubtedly be a one-of-a-kind experience well worth the wait. And now for the release date. Top Gun Maverick was recently screened at CinemaCon to a reportedly ecstatic audience. The film will have had its global premiere on May 4th at the San Diego Comic Con, and it will be released in theaters in the United States and Canada on May 27th of 2022. It will be accessible on Paramount Plus 45 days following its theatrical release, meaning that the picture will be released over three years beyond its intended release date. But we hope the wait was worthwhile since we couldn't be more excited. So there you have it folks, are you just as excited for the return of Maverick and Top Gun Maverick? Let us know down in the comments below. 
With this though, we're going to wrap up the video, so if you enjoyed it, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more incredible videos like this one. We hope to meet you guys again in the next video, but until then, I'll catch you later.